we finally got snow. It's now the third week of deer season, 2022. So I got a free day off of classes to come out and hunt. And I'm near the Allagash. There's a lot of people out this morning. Um, I've already seen like six trucks on my drive-in. And someone already drove in on this little road ahead of me. But I'm just going to come out here and try to cut a track. I don't know if the deer have been moving much already. But we got about 10 inches to a foot of snow. So a little more than we needed for tracking. But I'll get in the woods and see if the deer are moving at all yet. And have a fun day of it. I was just coming down this little old tote road in the woods and then I thought I could smell a deer. It smelled like a buck in the rut, like a really musty smell. So I just kept going and like 20 yards farther down the road, I came to a fresh deer track. It came from the right side of the road, went down the road a little ways and now right here is where it goes back in to the woods on the left hand side. There's so much snow, it's kind of hard to see the print itself. But I don't think it's that big of a deer. Just because its feet aren't that wide apart. And it's not taking very long strides. But it's really fresh. Because it snowed all through the night and there's no fallen snow in it. It looks just like the track that I make in terms of how fresh it is. So I'm just going to follow this. I don't know actually whether it's a buck or a doe, but I'm just going to go slow and easy since I think I'm close behind it. I think I just really lucked out here to find a fresh track, even though I got a late start today. So we'll see what happens. A few minutes ago, I left that doe track because uh, it was just kind of zigzagging and going through a bunch of brush and I was pretty sure it wasn't a buck. And then I was walking along a hardwood ridge, just kind of continuing along, hoping to cut a buck track. And I just kind of looked up and saw a deer's body like 15 yards away and its head was right behind a tree. So I just froze and watched it. And like 30 seconds later, um, behind it I saw another deer walking down the ridge toward me and it was two does and I watched them for almost 10 minutes um, one was like 20 yards from me standing right here it had just stood up out of its bed and was watching me and the other doe was just up the hill up there and they had heard me coming but didn't know what I was and they were just kind of standing looking around and then after about 10 minutes, they wandered off over that way. And they never even ran, so they're not too spooked. But it was fun to see two deer that close. Still no bucks, but still have the whole day. I've been following a bunch of different tracks all day and the snow's so deep it's really hard for me to tell how big the tracks actually are. So I followed three or four that eventually crawl through really tight blowdowns and stuff and I keep thinking that I'm on doe tracks instead of buck tracks and it's now mid-afternoon and I was just following one and then it made a tiny rub so I was pretty happy to know that I was at least finally on a buck track. I'm not holding out for a big one but I know that this is at least a buck and it was a little older so I was pushing on pretty hard and then I came to his bed right here 
with fresh tracks running away. So I don't have that much more daylight, but I'm just gonna ease along on this and see if I can get him. I ended up tracking that deer until darkness today and I never got a look at him, but I had a fun hunt and I was in an area with lots of deer, but there was so much snow, it was kind of hard for me to tell how big the tracks were. So I was glad to see a couple of does and track a couple deer and then got near that buck toward the end of the day and caught up to him, but I couldn't close the deal on him. So it was a fun first day of tracking for this year and the snow's here and I think it's here to stay, to stay with over a foot. So I'm gonna hit it hard for the last week of the season. It's still snowing right now. And hopefully kill a big one. <laughs> 